Hello and welcome to the how-to video on doing a wireless sync between time slips and eye slips. The first thing you will need to do is select the database you want to use with eye slips. If you are going to be using a TS Remote database, you must check the option Database is a TS Remote database. There is an option Send Data to Eye Slips which allows you to control if any data such as clients, tasks, etc. are sent to iSlips. This option is useful for when you have a large database that does not change very often and you want to save time syncing. Now that iSlip sync has been set up, let's go ahead and do a wireless sync. The first thing we'll need to do is go into iSlips on the iPhone or iPad. On the iPhone you will select Sync Data. Make sure the sync option is set to wireless and select the start button. iSlips is now set up to allow iSlip Sync to find your device to sync with. Within iSlip Sync, you will select the look for devices to sync with option to find your device and perform a sync. After the sync has completed, iSlips will present a success message and iSlip Sync will also log that the sync was successful. At this point, you will want to stop iSlip Sync from searching for devices by unchecking the Look for Devices to Sync With option. This concludes the how to video on doing a wireless sync between time slips and iSlips. Thank you for being a customer and please send us any feedback or suggestions you might have.